Hey friends, it's me! <laughs> I know once again it's been a really long time since my last video, I'm really sorry about that. But again, I've just not really had much time. Um, I think I say it every video, but if you guys want to follow me outside of YouTube, um, my links are usually down below. I'm really active on things like Twitter, and I'm probably going to be making a new DeviantArt account soon. I do have a really old one, but I think I want a fresh start. So, um... But yeah, if you if you ever need to get a hold of me or anything like that, Twitter's your best bet. It's at Kirari Boom and it'll be down below in the comments. Not in the comments. In the description down below, in the doobly doo. So make sure to check check that out if you want to get in touch with me. Um this is just a really quick doodle for this video because I really wanted to get something out there and talk to you guys and as well thank everybody for subscribing that has subscribed lately. I know I've not been posting any videos but I've still been gaining subscribers so that's really 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 made me happy. So thank you very much if you have recently subscribed and especially to you guys that have been subscribed for a while as well and stayed there even though I'm so uh what's the word? Um, <laughs> I'm not sure. So yeah, this is just a really quick chibi drawing of myself walking in the rain. I got the idea because I was walking to work the other day and it was raining and I had a new umbrella and I thought it was really cute and my lovely friend as well drew me with this umbrella. So if you want to see that, go check out Twitter. It's up there. I've retweeted it. It's so cute. Um. But yeah, it's a really cute umbrella, so I wanted to draw it, and that's basically where this drawing comes from. And I added one of my cat's mochi into the picture as well, because I thought it would be cute. Though I've realised that I'm not very good at drawing cats. <laughs> I wanted to keep the style simple, and I tried something different with the line art, so hopefully it turned out well. Let me know what you guys think. I've also recently bought some gouache, uh, the Winter and Newton kind, so... Um, I will probably be doing a, a video on that soon. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to do like a first impressions video or if I'm going to have a play with it first and then maybe draw when I feel more comfortable and know what I'm doing. Let me know what you think. If you want to see me just go in blind or if you want me to practice first and then upload a drawing with the gouache. I don't know. I've also been asked a lot lately about commissions. Um, I do actually take commissions, but um, I don't usually post about it on Twitter. I sort of have a website that I have continuous business on, so I've never really advertised them anywhere. But feel free if you do want a commission to uh, message me about it, because I mean, I'm always happy to talk to you guys about whatever, even if you just want to say hello. I wanted to keep the outfit uh, clothes that I actually own, um, which is why the top's cut in such a weird way. Um, and it made me sad because my coat is like this dingy green colour and I wanted to make the, the colours on this drawing really cute and pop poppy, but never mind. Can't have everything. But yeah, this is just a doodle. It took me less than an hour start to finish, including the sketch, so I'm sure there's a lot of things that I could have done better, including the triangle feet. I've also been uh, preparing myself for an a convention I'm going to be dealing at a table most likely um, I'm not going to post too many details yet because the convention is a long while away and I've said I'm going to do tables before and sort of backed out at the last minute due to either confidence or just time so I'm not going to post too much details yet but I've been working on prints and hopefully you'll see some of that stuff soon
this umbrella gave me a lot of trouble. I'm not the best at drawing like straight lines or like I know they're not technically straight, but a long continuous line, I'll say. So in the end, I just made one little one and copied it three times and it sort of came out okay. Um, it'll do the trick. Like I said, it's just a doodle, so I wasn't too worried about some things. Hmm, what else should I talk about? If you guys didn't know, I work outside of that um, as an operator for BT and one of my jobs is uh, I take calls for the emergency services and yesterday, Friday, was the, emer was the 999 services 80th birthday so that was really nice and fun. Uh, we had TV crews over and uh, we were interviewed and things like that and we had cake and balloons so... I mean, who doesn't love cake and balloons? I had so much cake today. There was like a lot of leftover birthday cake and the managers kept coming around like, mm, do you want any cake? Of course I did. <laughs> I've just put in a big order as well to a local art store for some new art supplies. Um, the lady that worked there said she could get me you know, she could source me things that I'm I'm after and probably give me a little bit of a discount as well. So I've given her a big list of stuff that I'm interested in, including a light box, which will make traditional drawing so much easier for me. Um, but if you guys have got any art supplies that you regularly use, let me know what they are. Um, I've asked for things like Copic markers, of course, Pro markers, of course, uh, the Kurataki pen. Uh, what else did I ask for? Hmm color race. I asked for all sorts of things but I want to make it an extensive list and send it over so just let me know if there's anything you think I should try or anything you want me to test out even. Um, I'd love to do like a review or something on my channel so. Something I've been asked and asked again for lately as well is a tutorial. Um, I've been asked for like a hair tutorial, a shading tutorial, things like that um, and I've said it before but I don't think that I'll do any. Um, I might do something like if you guys were interested maybe a live stream where you could ask me live specific things and I could help you live but I don't know if I'd do a video of it because I don't know if I'm if I feel comfortable in teaching in that way. Maybe I would, or maybe I'd film the live stream and upload that for people to see. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I've also been meaning to do a Draw Your OCs series, um, which I've been really excited for, but just haven't had the time to organize. But uh, I would like to get started as soon as possible. So if you guys want to send me some OCs, I don't know if you can leave them in the comments below. But you could do that or if you tweet them at me and I will record myself drawing your OC basically. Um, I'd love it if you told me a little bit about your OC so I could talk about them in the video, things like that. Um, but if you just want to send me a design, that's fine too. I'm not sure if it would be uh, like... A whole video dedicated to one OC and like a big intricate drawing or if I do sketches and doodles and well not doodles but quicker pictures of several OCs per video um, I'll have to see how it goes I think I'd probably do just one OC and do like a more rendered picture but I'm not sure yet Well, that's all I had to say for this video, so hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of the speed paint. Uh, leave me all your questions, comments, anything down below. Let me know how your day went, and let me know if there's a video you want to see, whether it's an art video or a pet video or whatever. Uh, put it down in the comments below. Remember to get me on Twitter, and I will see you next time. Ta-ra!